Uh, so my name's Anne Dodwell. I'm the project officer for the Creative Employment Program. Um, so I help sort of support the whole Creative Employment Program team with um, managing all the grants and doing all the administrative tasks that kind of underpin all of the activity that we do really. Um, I was really interested in the arts at school and university, like all sorts of different types of arts, from kind of drama to just general painting, and I knew that I wanted to work in the arts, um, sort of when I'd finished university. So um, I was lucky enough to get a place on a paid internship programme, so I started off my first kind of real uh, job in the arts, was working at the v &A as part of a future jobs funded uh, scheme. So. From that, it's kind of given me uh, a real insight into the benefit of programmes like the Creative Employment Programme. Um, as you're kind of a young person starting out and you uh, you get to kind of really experience the world of work and it was, it was really fantastic, the programme that we were on, because we also got sort of mentoring and training and there were masterclasses that happened on a weekly basis. So you really felt like you were involving yourself in the arts at all different levels as well as in the workplace you were also doing this extra stuff outside of it which was really great for learning networking skills and um, and, and just kind of boosting your confidence and your contacts. Um, so I, uh, from my paid internship I then ended up um, helping, I was called back to ask help run a, a following phase of, uh, of that program which then uh, was viewed as the pilot for the creative employment program um, so just, it's just sort of carried, carried through so to speak. It's just such a dynamic sector, there's always lots of things going on you know, in the different art forms themselves and it's always interesting to find out about what specific art forms are doing within the sector. Um, working with the Creative Employment Programme team and for Creative and Cultural Skills is really fantastic, we're quite a close-knit, small organisation, um, so it's sort of dealing with the daily challenges of, of, of managing um, sort of a grant program and, and talking to all of the applicants that come through and helping people with their inquiries uh, and trying to get more people involved and promote the message of sort of fairer employment for young people. It's just kind of that toe in the door, the paid internship, it's someone who's willing to take a chance on you and then through your internship you can kind of give give that chance taking you can give that back to them um, by working really hard and seizing all the opportunities that are given to you but it was just kind of that toe in the door that has sort of allowed me to grow and flourish I think it's a case of part of its persistence um, you've really got to know what you want to do and then your passion for it will come across in any interview that you have. And it's also, you know, if, if at first you don't succeed, because I went for lots of interviews for things before I actually ended up getting this paid internship, uh, my, my first paid internship placement, um, it's useful to just kind of get feedback from people and then you can build on that to, to go forward but it's you know do your homework and and try and research the either the company or the industry that you're wanting to go into and that will that kind of along with your enthusiasm for for the sector will absolutely carry through an interview